Hi! In this circuit, we use the components like the push buttons and red and green LEDs in place of dual LED due to non-availability of the component in Tinkercad. Along with the power indicator circuit we built earlier. Let's build this circuit in Tinkercad and simulate it. We will first build the power supply circuit, which is common for all our projects. Let's draw the components mentioned on the circuit diagram seen earlier. So, we will draw the USB standard A connector LED red and resistor of value 1 kilo ohms. We will connect as follows. The 5 volt positive of the USB to the terminal 2 of the resistor. This is positive line. So, we shall select the wire color red. Terminal 1 of the resistor to the anode of the LED. Cathode of the LED to the ground of the USB connector. This is negative line, so we shall select the wire color black. We will now complete the rest of the circuit, for which we shall draw the push buttons, resistor of value 330 ohms, and the LED red and LED green from the component library and wire them as follows. Terminal 1B of the push button 1 to the terminal 2 of the resistor 1 kilo ohms. Terminal 2A of the push button 1 to the anode of the red LED. Cathode of the red LED to the terminal 2 of the resistor 330 ohms. Terminal 1B of the push button 2 to the terminal 1B of the push button 1. Terminal 2A of the push button 2 to the anode of the green LED. Cathode of the green LED to the terminal 2 of the resistor 330 ohms. Terminal 1 of the resistor 330 ohms to the cathode of the LED. We have now completed the circuit. Let's start the simulation. Glowing red LED indicates the circuit is powered, but the dual LED is not glowing as the circuit is open. When we push this button 1 and close the circuit, the dual LED glows in red. When we release the push button, again the circuit is open and the LED turns off. When we push this button 2 and close the circuit, the dual LED glows in green. When we release the push button, again the circuit is open and the green LED turns off. This is how we light up a dual LED. This circuit has many applications. A few examples could be power indicators for electronic devices like TV and so on. You can now build your own circuit. Download the image file and submit in the assignment. Circuit explanation. In this project, current flows in three closed paths. The path one is a power indicator circuit seen earlier in project one. When powered up, the red LED glows indicating that the circuit is powered. Dual LED 
as the name suggests, emits dual color lights, green and red, one at a time or together. But here in Tinkercad, dual LED is not available in the component library. So we took two different color, red and green LEDs and connected them like a dual LED. When you press the push button in path 2, electric current flows from the positive 5 volt terminal of the USB through the push button and then through the red terminal of the dual LED, then to resistor 330 ohms to ground negative, completing the path 2 and emitting red light. When you press the push button in path 3, electric current flows from the positive 5 volt terminal of the USB through the push button and then through the green terminal of the dual LED, then to resistor 330 ohms to ground negative, completing the path 3 and emitting green light. When you press both the push buttons in path 2 and path 3, electric current flows from the positive 5 volt terminal of the USB through both the push buttons and through both the red and green terminals of the dual LED, then to resistor 330 ohms to ground negative, completing both the paths and emitting a unique color. The unique color is the combination of red and green colors. Have fun! Cheers!